denseness property of rational numbers so we'll see what is this property so what is denseness so for example between two rational numbers say x and y if you take x is one rational number y is a rational another rational number so there is always a rational number between these both so any rational numbers if you take between them there will be one more rational number that is x plus y by 2 is exactly middle of this both and similarly x plus y by 2 is one number y is another number again between these there exists another rational number so that means by repeated use of this property so we can say that there is infinitely many rational numbers between two rational numbers so if you take any two rational numbers for example 2 by 3 5 by 6 so between these there is infinite number of rational numbers so this only denseness property then we can find out how many rational numbers there are that way we can find out so let's see, uh, see the problem wise for example find the rational number between 3 by 5 is one number and 5 by 7 between these two just find a rational number so first i'll explain in brief then i'll show you one shortcut method also how to find out only one rational number if they asked they're simple we can add this both and divide by two so your question is only find one rational number find one rational number between these two that we can write 3 plus 3 by 5 plus 5 by 7 divide by 2 this is the number between these two rational numbers and another rational number right you simplify this 3 7 5 7 lcm 35 then normal addition of uh, rational numbers 21 25 okay. this is 46 by 35 divide by 2 this you can write 46 by 35 divided by 2 is 1 by 2 if you cancel 23 then 23 by 35 is a number between these both that means 3 by 5 5 by 7 between this 23 by 35 is a rational number if it is only one rational number if they ask like this you can do for example find more than one like 3 4 5 or 10 rational numbers between them so we see okay let me take one question find four rational numbers find four rational numbers uh, between 1 by 4 and 1 by 3 okay so same question in detail we'll see and uh, same question we'll see the shortcut also now if you want to solve this First, in between these, I should find out one rational number. That means between 1 by 4 and 1 by 3, there should be 1, 2, 3, 4 rational numbers. Okay, these four places I need to find out. Then, first step, we can add this both and divide by 2, we will get one number in center. So, if you use the property. 1 by 4 plus 1 by 3 divided by 2. If you solve, this is one of the number between them. That is, um, if you simplify, 3 plus 4 by 4, 3 is a 12, divided by 2. And 7 by 12 divided by 2 is 1 by 2. Then that is 7 by 24, right? So 7 by 24 is one of the number in between. That means 1 by 4 less than 7 by 24 less than 1 by 3. So between 1 by 4 and 1 by 3, 7 by 24 is one of the rational numbers, right? Now, we need find out 4 rational numbers. Then we can take, in these both also we should find out 1. That means 1 by 4 and 7 by 24. So between these two we can find out 1 number. That means you can simplify again. If you take yeah. so between these two and between these two so for this we'll get one number in between we'll get one number 
that is 1 by 4 plus 7 by 24 add both and divide by 2 that is one of the number in between them and similarly 7 by 24 plus 1 by 3 and divide by 2 this is the another number okay, if you simplify then you can simplify 24 plus 7 by 28 by 4 into 24 finally if you simplify I will get this is a 13 by 48 simplify total so you can simplify and check I am writing answer right here that is 13 by 48 and here if you take this is a 5 by 16 finally if you cancel it that is 5 by 16 so this value now now you can write the statement like this finally what you got 1 by 4 is a given value 1 by 4 and 1 by 3 is given between these both we got 7 by 24 right and between 1 by 4 and 7 by 24 I got 13 by 48 and between 7 by 24 and 1 by 3 is 5 by 16 just add the both numbers and divide by 2 so we got 1 2 3 we are asking 4 now take any two numbers and between these you can find out one more right so this is the way you can take any two numbers and again you find out so 1 by 4 and 13 by 28 so 1 by 4 plus 13 by 48 divided by 2 this value if you simplify that is 1 by 4 plus 13 by 48 and divided by 2 is that is 25 by 96 so you can do calculation check so finally we got four values right so 1 by 4 1 by 3 these two are given now in between these both 7 by 24 7 by 24 it is I can raise. yes now between 1 by 4 and 7 by 24 I got 13 by 48 13 by 48 so in between these both 25 by 96 okay here is both is 5 by 16 right finally 1 2 3 4 these four are the rational numbers between 1 by 4 and 1 by 3 so this is take uh, more time so instead of this how to simplify directly how to find out how many numbers they asked so let's see the same question find out the four rational numbers between 1 by 4 and 1 by 3 right now let's see so I need to find out four rational numbers between 1 by 4 and 1 by 3. So it's a simple is just see the denominators 4 and 3. Take 4, 3 LCM. Okay, 4 1s are 4, 3. Again, 3 1s are 3 here. 4 into 3 is 12. LCM is 12. Now I should make denominator is 12 for both. Now it is 1 by 4 and 1 by 3 this is a shortcut trick you can follow just keep multiply so what number if you multiply both numerator and denominator to get the denominator as 12 so if you want to 4 3 is a 12 same 3 multiply here here is 4 by 4 because 4 3 4 is a 12 now this is 3 by 12 and it is 4 by 12 so 3 by 12 4 by 12 there is no any gap again that means after 3 immediately 4 will come now I should increase the denominator more so you can multiply one more number just increase same number same number multiply and divide ok I am taking 3 by 3 3 by 3 same because already denominator is 12 both places now 3 3 is a 9 by 12 3 is a 36 and 4 3 is a 12 by 12 3 is a 36 right now between 9 by 36 12 by 36 you can write 10 by 36 11 by 36 but next only 12 by 36 only 2 we are getting now increase the denominator more ok up to here we have only 10 by 36 11 by 36 next automatically is 12 by 36 but we need 4 rational numbers so you can increase the denominator 9 by 36 12 by 36 just multiply with 2 by 2 now so if you extend like this you can find out now 9 2 is up 18 by 36 to the 72 
Now denominators are same, so we can increase the numerators. 18 by 72, 24 by 72. In between 19, yeah, 19 by 72, 20 by 72, 21 by 72, and 22 by 72. These four are the rational numbers because next is even 23 by 72 also. These four are the rational numbers between uh, 1 by 4 and 1 by 3. So that you can take. These are the four rational numbers between 1 by 4 and 1 by 3. That's it. So you can increase the denominator. Let's okay, check one. We do one more problem. Okay, find a insta of uh, well, let's take some nine rational numbers. So if they are given some decimal number, that's how to find out. For example, if the fractions are given, check the denominator and do. Now find nine rational numbers. This is also a shortcut I'll explain. Find nine rational numbers between 0 and 0 0.1. So decimals also you can convert into fractions. Right? Between 0 and 0 0.1, you need to find out 9 rational numbers. So let I will explain your shortcut tree. Between 0 and 0 0.1. So let A is equal to 0 and B is equal to 0 0.1. In between, I need to do 9 rational numbers. Right? So take N is equal to 9. So we need to know the difference between every rational number. This is a formula you can use d is equals to b minus a by n plus 1. This formula if you use d is the difference between every two rational numbers. So b minus a by n plus 1. b is 0 0.1 minus a is 0 by n plus 1 is 9 plus 1. 0 0.1 by 10. 0 0.1 by 10 is 0 0.01 right. So this is the gap between the rational numbers. Now it's simple. First value is 0 and last value is 0 0.1. Now between every two rational numbers, this is the difference, this is the gap because I applied this formula. 0 0.01. Now 0 plus 0 0.01 is 0 0.01. Again, if for every number, add 0 0.01. 0 0.02 and 0 0.03. So on till 0 0.09. Then 0 0.1 will come automatically. So 1, 0 0.012 to 0 0.09. These are the 9 rational numbers between 0 and 0. Okay, this is the difference formula I apply. You can do in this way also. And this is the property. So denseness property means we can make. The only thing is by repeated use of this above property, we can get there are infinity many rational numbers between two rational numbers. Any two rational numbers if we take, even 2, 3, there will be infinite rational numbers between 2 and 3. Even 2, comma 2.1 also, there will be infinite rational numbers between these two. So, this is a denseness property of rational numbers. Right? Then, using this property, you can do the problems also. And we will see how to solve. This is up to rational numbers. Next, we will see about uh, irrational numbers and how to solve them problems also regarding that.